What do you remember about Gehanna during the days that you attended the Gehanna One Room Schoolhouse? I think there were about 400 people. You knew everybody. You'd go up and down the street, you knew everybody in Gehanna. Everybody knew you. We lived on McCutcheon Road right there. At, uh, it goes into Stigler. So uh, it was only just a half a mile. So we, uh, we just walked to school. We went there to the, to the grocery and we went to church. The Earls had lived there all their lives and so that it, it was well known. What can you tell us from your memories about Kahana's one room schoolhouse? We're all in the uh, one building in, in Gehanna. It was a very small group. There were only just two other ones in my class. It was a very small class. When I went down, I was then in the first grade. There weren't very many in there. I was the only one. So on the second day when he called, he didn't call first grade. He called second grade. So he said I was then in the second grade. So I skipped the whole first grade. I was the youngest one in my class all the way through. In fact, when I graduated and in June I was 16, <laughs> so I was only there the one year, you see, since uh, we went, uh, when I was in the third grade, then we moved over to Canada Grade School. And my teacher was Mr. Gibbs, and he drove uh, to uh, school in his two-seated buggy and a uh, horse, and we thought that was great to see that horse. There was, of course, an outhouse in the back and, and, uh, and a stream going along the, of the yard. So we played out there, did all our running games. We didn't play ball, but we played all running games. There was a big fence out in the back with a big, broad top. We used to sit out there and eat our lunch out there. We took our lunches every day, and, and my brother was, always went down early and started the fire. Every uh, holiday we would have a big program and invite all the parents, of course. We, we had reading and writing and arithmetic and that's about all. Why do you believe that it's important that current Gehanna students experience a one-room schoolhouse? I think too many people don't know what it was like. And I think it, was, it, it really was an experience that I'm glad I had. When you talk about it, they say, well, it's very strange, you know. But there weren't that many people, so you didn't need a big school. And the modern teacher took care of all of them. I think they could learn that uh, there would be all the grades in one, in one room. See how it was to just have one teacher do all your classes.